Esri Story Maps lets us combine authoritative maps with narrative text, images, and multimedia content. They make it easy to harness the power of maps and geography to tell your story, to inspire and to convince. We can build a compelling story map that allows city officials to communicate with citizen stakeholders to view development proposals or analyze in 3D for things like shadows. There are a number of story map templates, each with particular strengths for particular types of story. The template you choose depends on what you want to communicate, but you can use the Ask the Pros button to get some suggestions based on the type of story you want to tell and the types of media that you have. We've chosen a story map journal, ideal for combining narrative text with our 3D scene. It consists of a number of sections for stakeholders to scroll through, with a primary viewing area for our 3D scene, a side panel for explanatory text, and other media such as images or hyperlinks. We already have a story map that we want to add to, so we can choose to edit it from our story map homepage. Clicking Edit Story enables us to add a section to our story map showing our neighborhood redevelopment. Click Add section and choose a web page as the content. Paste in the web URL from our See the Difference web application and then name the section Neighborhood Redevelopment. We can configure the content so that it's full page. Then click to edit the side panel. Here we'll add some text and a couple of images showing some viewshed analysis. By clicking the Insert button, we can add an image, video, or another web page. In this case, we'll upload an image of a viewshed analysis that we completed in ArcGIS Pro. Hit Apply, and it appears in the side panel. When we're done, we can see our web app in the main section. We may want to update slides in the web scene since we don't have a lot of real estate to work with, and that's just a matter of opening the web scene in ArcGIS Online, deleting one of the slides, and saving. Although first, we will rename the first slide because we want to indicate that there's LiDAR in it, and then we'll save the scene. So the web app containing our web scene will be updated, and our story map will be too. Once we're done, we can save our story map. Finally, we can share our story map, making it private, available to groups within our organization, or making it public. We've got some URLs to share or embed, and we're ready to tell our story. Our world is 3D, and 3D maps are fast becoming a must-have to improve understanding and communication with both internal stakeholders and citizen stakeholders. Especially when planning, designing, or managing our cities and communities, 3D GIS data can add enormous value to our organization. Using 3D GIS data within web scenes and story maps makes it easier to understand for non-technical audiences, which leads to better communication and better collaboration.